trigonometry values how to remember the trigonometry values so the topic is trigonometry values so how to remember this trigonometry values by using hand short tricks okay so let me draw a hand So this is the hand okay so let me mark the values as 0 degrees 30 degrees 45 degrees 60 degrees and 90 degrees so these are the trigonometry ratio values so in this we have two directions one is clockwise direction another one is anti-clockwise direction clockwise direction and anti-clockwise direction so we need to write the values for theta which is sin theta cos theta these two are important right remaining things are very simple for us if i want tan theta just i will write sin theta by cos theta something by something cot theta cos by sin if i write like that cosecant 1 by something secant 1 by something if i write like that we will get remaining values so our main focus is on sine and cos only okay so let me write 0 degrees 30 degrees 45 degrees 60 degrees and 90 degrees now here theta to get theta the format is root of number of fingers divided by 2 root of number of fingers divided by 2 in the clockwise direction i am taking sin theta in order to get this in the anti clockwise direction i am taking cos theta so root of number of fingers divided by 2 if i want value for sin theta so root of so 0 degrees i want 0 degrees means here our arrow is here so you can see my arrow is here so in order to know sin theta i want to see clockwise direction if i want cos theta i want to look at anti clockwise direction now i am writing formulas or values for sin theta for sin theta i need to look in clockwise direction for cos theta i need to look at anti clockwise direction remember this now i am looking towards clockwise direction uh, my pointer is at 0 degrees now tell me this is my hand how many fingers are there this side if this is my hand there are no fingers as there are no fingers root 0 by 2 root 0 by 2 means root 0 by 2 means the answer is 0 so the value here we got 0 so next one 30 degrees 30 degrees means now my pointer is here if my pointer is here how many fingers in clockwise direction this is my pointer there is one finger right so root of 1 by 2 root 1 value is 1 by 2 if i want 45 degrees means here so that means here so how many fingers this side there are two fingers that means there are two fingers means the formula will be root of number of fingers are 2 root 2 by 2 normal 2 can be written as root 2 into root 2 which is 2 root 2 root 2 gets cancelled will get 1 by root 2 and then 60 degrees means my pointer is here so my pointer is here how many fingers this side 3 fingers so what I will get root of number of fingers which is root of 3 by 2 hence directly root 3 by 2 if i want the next one 90 degrees 
means my finger is here my pointer is here how many number of fingers in clockwise direction 1 2 3 4 4 fingers root 4 by 2 root 4 can be written as 2 2 by 2 which is nothing but 1 so in this way we can able to easily write these values if i reverse these values then you can you know that those are cos theta values otherwise from the diagram we'll see how to get these values okay so first zero degrees now we need to change the direction anti-clockwise direction cos theta is present at anti-clockwise direction hence we need to look anti-clockwise direction look here so zero means from here onwards there are four fingers root four by two which is one next here the pointer 30 means there are three fingers which is root three by two next here root there are two fingers root two by two normal two can be written as root two into root two root two root two cancel one by root two and here there is only one finger root one value is one one by two 90 degrees there are no fingers zero so root zero by two which is nothing but what will get it as how much zero so in this way we use it we got the values of trigonometry values here now if i want if you want tan theta for example if you want the further things like tan theta you can able to easily write here by extending you can see if i want tan theta you know that tan theta is sin theta by cos theta which is 0 by 1 0 so 1 by 2 by root 3 by 2 so 2 2 gets cancelled 1 by root 3 this value and next value what you will get 45 1 by root 2 1 by root 2 cancel 1 and next value root 3 1 by 0 next value infinity so these are the values that you will get right so if you want cot theta what you will get just reverse it infinity root 3 1 1 by root 3 and 0 okay and if you want secant theta you can make 1 by cos theta if you want cosecant theta you can make 1 by sin theta then you are going to get the values so for secant theta what are the values you will get for secant theta let me extend few more so for secant theta i am extending 1 by cos so take the cos 1 by cos which is 1 so 0 degrees is 1 next 1 by cos just write reverse 2 by root 3 and just write reverse root 2 then write reverse 2 1 by 0 infinity so these are the values you will get okay hence lastly if you want cosecant theta just write opposite infinity 2 root 2 2 by root 3 and 1 otherwise 1 by sin theta you can write you are going to get the values so this is a very shortcut trick by using your hand fingers you can able to get the major values as sin and cos if you get the values of sin and cos you can able to get any kind of values okay if you want this kind of videos all of you subscribe our channel which is technogate space education this is our youtube channel so like share and subscribe our youtube channel you will get this kind of videos here and further follow our instagram page which is technogate underscore education in order to get jobs related information and education related information 
follow our instagram page